if all of us have this pressure or you know i don't know how you feel especially as parents one thing i have realized uh, you know after uh, a long time of looking onto things and asking questions and doing some study here and there and some researches asking all people questions and all this is that you know our most marriages are breaking because we as parents we are not training our children to be good people to other people nor are we training them to be good enough to themselves to accommodate other people but we are raising up problems knowingly that my child is a problem but you expect someone's child to understand the problem that you've raised and make the problem be good if you as a parent you've been unable to rise up or to raise up or to grow someone who is a solution to the community how do you expect someone's son to become or someone's daughter is vice versa vis -a -vis someone's daughter to be uh, you know a solution to the problem that you raised so all these things are because parents we're not doing our best to raise up children who are responsible and of help within our communities that is why marriages are breaking each and every time and once you've known that you've raised a problem to the community and you expect the other son uh, the other person's son or daughter to uh, you know to be understanding and good enough to problem wherever the problems arises you as the first person who raised a problem in the name of a child you be the first person to point a finger to someone's son or someone's daughter as the source of the problems that your problem you raised up is facing and you say all manner of words speak all manner of evil words against the other person's son or daughter thinking that they're the problem but the real problem is the problem that you raised in the name of your son and daughter so we have a role if marriages have to work then as parents if the community has to work then as parents we ought to raise up people who are ready for those marriages if you have a son you ought to raise up a husband and a father and if you have a daughter you ought to raise up a mother and a wife raise up that daughter and with an understanding that at one point she'll become a mother and she'll become a wife to someone and if you have a son I rise up that son in a way that he understands that I'll given at a given point he will become a father and a husband to someone so when they get into marriage they understand their roles and their responsibilities irrespectively ama respectively so don't you think as parents we've messed up and we are crying each and every day when people beat each other in marriages, abuse each other in marriages. We're really complaining so much that marriages are not working. It's because as parents, we never raised up husbands and fathers. We never raised up mothers and wives. We raised up problems in the names of sons and daughters. Mm -hmm. We need to go back to the drawing board and do everything that we're supposed to do in the right way. Thank you so much. Make sure you're raising up. If you have a daughter, rise up a wife and a mother. If you have a son, rise up a husband and a father. Mm -hmm. See you.